Hi everyone, it's Kristen and we are back talking about engagement strategies, which are just some simple things to strengthen the bond with your child. We've talked about three engagement strategies so far, touch, eye contact, and behavior matching. And right now we're gonna talk about the fourth, which is voice quality. So voice quality communicates an important message about your mood, your trustworthiness, and your authority. And you can pretty much tell who a safe person is by their voice quality, by the way they're talking and their tone of voice. So when I say voice quality, I mean three things, your tone, your volume, and your cadence. So your tone is how you sound. Is it harsh? Is it warm? Is it friendly? Is it kind and gentle? Is it maybe a little bit mean and condescending? Um, I'm sure you've all had this experience as well, but there's been times where I have said something and I'm just like, whoa, can we take that back and put it back in there? Because that did not come out the way that I wanted it to. Um, your volume, so that's how loud or how quiet you're talking. And then your cadence is how quickly you're talking. It's your pace. So we can be aware of our voice quality, our tone, our volume, and cadence in communicating with children. So during times when things are going well, you can be friendly and warm and engagement. You can talk engaging. You can talk a little bit faster. Um, during times when maybe things are starting to get rocky, you're going to slow your cadence down a bit. You'll be a little bit firmer, maybe bust out a little bit of that authoritative voice. Um, yelling isn't actually helpful um, when when a child gets yelled at they go into their downstairs brain and our downstairs brain is actually our primitive survival brain that's our fear center and when you're in your downstairs brain you can't access your higher executive functioning so you can't process a lot of information so during those times when children are afraid and they don't feel safe what's best is just short simple few words um, you're not trying to throw a lot of information at them because they can't process it so being aware of your voice quality of your tone your volume and your cadence um, can also help with connecting with your child and and for strengthening that bond um, i'm really excited because we have tackled four out of the five engagement strategies so tune in next time as we talk about number five